Good morning guys from the Warren National Forest. Today we are uh, gonna be tackling the Dirty D trails. Uh, I've got another video that I've done in the past uh, where I take a group from the Southern Four Wheel Drive Association. Today I'm with my buddy Jesse. Uh, you guys have seen him in previous videos, uh, but we're gonna go uh, tackle Dickie Bell first. Uh, then I think we're gonna do Dutch John, maybe the backside of Daniel, maybe even the front side of Daniel, who knows? So stick around. So even though Dickie Bell is not like the hardest trail uh, here at Iwari. It is a lot of fun. Uh, most of the trail is relatively easy with a few obstacles that peek their heads out every once in a while. But then you get to what is called Little Daniel. Uh, there are several options. There's a full on pretty much flat bypass. There's also a middle of the road and then there's an advanced path. Of course, it being Jesse's first time here, we went up the advanced path. what do you think of it, man? Um, I mean, it's, when you look at it from the bottom, it's incredibly intimidating. Um, I've only got like a two and a half inch lift, and so clearance was my only concern. And so as I was going up, what I thought would be a little more manageable on the right hand side, uh, there was a big difference in elevation from left to right. Um, and then just not having lockers, it, it, I didn't have enough traction to climb up that piece. So I reoriented and then got really close to the edge of the you know tree on this side on the left hand side and yeah it rusts with the with the spotting really helped out but yeah she did good i scraped the undercarriage a little bit but you know that's why we have protection under there do you feel like you earned the badge oh yeah 100 <laughs> percent. i was thinking you know if i'm here if this is the hardest thing and it's the first thing that we're going to do if something fails, we have all day to figure it out. Cool, let's go do the rest of it. Let's go. Okay, so we finished uh, Dickie Bell Trail. Now we took a little bit of Rocky Mountain Loop. We're gonna go to the backside of Daniel and uh, play in the little boulder field area for a little while and uh, go up to the top of the mountain, show you the great view because the leaves are absolutely gorgeous right now. And uh, yeah, we'll check in then. It's snack time. So we are now on trail 390, which is uh, Daniel Trail. Uh, right now we're going up the backside of Daniel. Um, it's a pretty steep hill climb, uh, but Pretty much like always, it's got the little bunny slope uh, kind of things. But anyway, this is what it looks like. So once you get down, uh, or sorry, once you get up the big hill climb, you're gonna come to the boulder field, or this is like the big playground. Uh, it's a lot of fun. There is a bypass all the way to the right. There's kind of intermediate line again in the middle and then uh, a little bit more jagged once you get out, you stay all the way to the left. So uh, we're gonna play around right here for a little bit, take some pictures and uh, uh, get on up to the top of the mountain and we'll show you. Uh, there's kind of like a second hill area and then we'll get all the way up to the very top. Uh, and there's some beautiful views, especially this time of year. Uh, so let's do it. You're good. You're good. Keep going. Just turn into it. There you go. Keep going, just keep steady on the throttle. Steady on the throttle.
going. trip uh, we did all the dirty D's and uh, yeah hope you had a good time riding along with us if you did make sure to like like subscribe uh, and share you know all the things that I really hate saying and until next time I hope you're living life adventurously and I will see you on the trail